Hi all folks, this is Max from Galaxy S2 Root.com. So I've got my AT&T Galaxy S2 um, here and uh, I've got the Turk B, Turk Bay ROM. Um, this one is pretty cool actually. It comes with uh, its own custom icons. Everything is customized. Um, and it even comes with a slightly narrower font. I don't know what it's called, but um, you get the nice left to right um, here. And uh, let me show you the lock screen. Um, that's kind of cool. And uh, it comes with the um, overclockable kernel. You can overclock it to 1.6 gigahertz, um, as you can see here. Um, so it's Turk B ROM. And uh, this one it looks really cool. Uh, I might stick with this for my Galaxy S2, the, the AT&T version, for a little bit and see how it goes. And also you get the five, five different ones. And you get the nice animation here um, while you do your thing. And uh, there's also um, several apps that come with it. It's even the super user has its own icon. That's kind of cool. Um, so if you're looking for something like more themed and, you know, maybe you like this theme, you can give this thing a try. And there's also... Um, Deluxe settings where you can change the lock screen, a um, whole bunch of different stuff, phone options, miscellaneous. I'm not going to go into it, but I'll, I'll let you mess with it. Better battery stats. Um, it's inside this ROM. It's in charge, so you can kind of see where all your battery things are going. Um, other than that, it's a pretty cool ROM, I would say. Um, Let's actually have a little fun with it. I got it set at 1.6 gigahertz, and uh, let's run Quadrant. And uh, this is a fun ROM, I think, to play with. Oh, there we go. And it seems to run pretty freaking fast. <laughs> That's all I can tell you. <clears throat> so it's running. You can see that the frames per second is really pretty fast, it's going over 60, um, hovering there. So it's almost done. Um, I'll have also a ROM review for T-Mobile and the other version, the Epic 4G Touch soon. Holy Jesus, you see that? 6227 so that that is freaking awesome fast um so it's a really fun rom to um play with i guess um it's obviously very very fast on at performance but um i recommend you to put it on on demand or conservative if you don't want to you know drain your battery and make your phone get hot anyway that was a review of turk b rom for at&t galaxy s2 please don't flash this on any other phone this is only for the SGH, um, is that SGH? Yes, SGH-D i777, the Galaxy S2 for the AT&T version. You should have an AT&T logo there. If you don't, don't flash this wrong. But it looks really fast. I, I got really high, high quadrant numbers and really smooth. Oh, I forgot to show you the dialer. Um, it does come with an ICS-themed dialer. Um, other than that, it's, it's a really cool ROM. I'm going to stick with this. Anyway, um, for those of you who have AT&T Galaxy S2, try it out. Let me know how it works for you, and let me know how the battery looks for you, works for you. But it should give you much better battery life over stock. Um, I really like it. So, see y'all later, and thanks. Subscribe.